Okay, this is an engine coolant temperature sensor that resides this way down, obviously because of the threads, in a thermostat housing of a 1994 Mercedes E320 wagon, and it's uh, the W124 body style. And my temperature gauge wasn't working at all. And I did some research. And this is one of the potential culprits. And I tested the, um, popped off the wire the other day and tested the wire, make sure the gauge in the instrument cluster was working. Because if that's the case, this is the problem. So, I just wanted to post a video of this because I just cleaned this up. Um, you know what? When you buy this, if you go to a Mercedes dealer, they're gonna, they're gonna, the, their asking price is fifty bucks, roughly. But if you get this from Pelican Parts or another online parts geek or something like that, they charge like eight bucks or seven bucks. <laughs> so anyway the um I noticed on here it's got the part markings and I verified that when I ordered a new one. So let me see if I can zoom in. This camera's pretty good. It's got a pretty good focus at uh macro level. So here is this is not the part number, it's just one of the markings on the on the part. So that's 01W39. As I, as I said, this is not the part number, but it's just there's nothing here on this side. And this says 120 degrees M2. I think that's an M. Anyway, this is probably 120 degrees Celsius max because that's what the gauge shows. This says 6 to 24 volts. Nothing on this side. And then here's the part number. Let's see how close I can get this. Let me put this down here. Here. Change the camera angle. Okay. it in my hand. Barely see it, but I believe if I remember it's zero zero five five 
The Mercedes, you can see the Mercedes symbol there. That is the Mercedes part number for this. That's pretty good, pretty good focus. That is the Mercedes part number for this sensor. And don't forget to order the the o-ring also it goes goes on it like that and you screw it into the into the thermostat housing so there you go if you are Coolant gauge isn't work, working in your instrument cluster. Um, check this first, and you can go to. Um, I'll put a link in the uh, description. Uh, the Mercedes source guy, Kent Bergsma, has a good video on troubleshooting on his um, Mercedes source website. Uh, he charges a couple, like four bucks for it. It's a, uh, anyway, I'll put the link to it and you can choose to buy it or not. But, um, anyway, that is the, uh, chances are that's, this is, this is the problem. And again, it's, it's like eight bucks online.